What subjects in the Bible do you believe contain inaccuracies? Well, that's a very good question because it's like um, almost every subject in the Bible contains some kind of inaccuracy. And uh, I suppose it depends on how important you find the inaccuracy as to how important it is to you. But I feel the Bible has, uh, as I've mentioned before, the Bible has a lot of flaws, um, but the Bible also has a lot of truths. But there are inaccuracies in almost every subject. So you can't sort of choose a subject and go, oh, the Bible is right on this particular subject right across the board, mm. because it is not correct on any subject right across the board. It either contains a, a lack of information on every subject, or it contains information that is false on the subject, or it contains information that has been embellished or manipulated through the period passage of time on a mm -hmm. particular subject. And you could say that about almost every subject it contains. So I suppose the best way we can, you know, the best thing we could say about the Bible is that we need to take a lot of care in our reading of the Bible. I feel it is an essential book to read myself. I feel it's an essential book to read. Perhaps not the whole of the book of the Bible, but certainly the New Testament of the Bible is essential to read. And if, if I was recommending to people what to read, I'd also recommend reading the Psalms, the Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, and many of the prophets as well, um, for a lot of reasons. Uh, and they can be very fascinating and interesting books to read if you understand how to read them. Mm -hmm. um, I would not necessarily recommend that everybody reads, you know, the first five books of the Bible in terms of, you know, particularly Leviticus, Numbers and, and per, per, perhaps Deuteronomy, which were part of the Pentateuch in, in, the, in our first century life, because they just contain many laws that uh, are not really valid for modern living. And they're also not valid when you consider them from the perspective of love. There are some that are, and some that aren't. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, again, the Bible, I feel, is a very important book to read, but, not, uh, but it's very important that you do not believe it is the entire Word of God. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank mm -hmm. you.